take one of the magnets and slide it all the way in to the magnet holder. One magnet in place. the magnets in place right we should have a D cell battery that's the big fat ones right. looks like I've got one that's handy in there. Right, not a lot happening. I don't know how good that battery is. Check it out with the meter. I've no idea if that battery's any good. That's just one that was laying on the shelf. <laughs> that looks like that battery's as flat as a pancake. Okay, so initial panic over, that battery's not going to do anything for us. I don't have many of these sorts of batteries, I never use them, they're much too big. Ah, but... Uh, 0.75, yeah that's pretty flat. So, we need to get an adapter and put a double A battery in there, that's the best I can do. Right, this is an adapter. So I can put a double A battery inside. Well that works, doesn't it? So we have a working electric motor. We better finish assembling the boat and try it out. There's our propeller. way round do we want it to go? Well I think just by luck I've actually got that the right way round. So 
So, boat that sits on there like that. Okay, why aren't we working now? We've stopped working. So that means a wire's come loose somewhere, but where? Ah, <laughs> that's the battery adapter. do it without can't see what I'm doing, can you? Let's put it back together. Because I'm using a, an adapter it's uh, a little bit fussy. I don't think you'd have the same problem if you had a, the right sort of battery in there. So. Anyway, we'll go and run some water in the bath and test it. Well guys, in my bathroom, we'll see if it floats. I've taken the liberty of actually adding a rudder. It's only a piece of thin metal. I've just cut a slot in the back there and just pushed it in place. Because I want it to go round in a circle as much as possible. Huh. Well the rudder's not doing very much. Well, that rather might have been helping, it was pushing it away from the side of it.
Well, the point is, the electric motor works and it's pushing the boat along quite easily. Until the battery ran down. Just need a little bit of readjustment. But I hope you can see that's working absolutely fine. Very simple. And the only modification I did to the original package was I didn't have the right size battery, but I do have a plastic adapter. So that's an ordinary AA battery inside there pumped up to look like a size D. Job done. Just a final point. Don't write to me and ask me for copies of the instructions because I've no doubt they're copyright. If you want to know how to build one of these boats then you're going to have to find the kit and read the instructions yourself. This actually came from Boots originally, which is a chemist, so I would guess it was probably Christmas stock for um, some Christmas or other. This would have been a few years ago, probably made by another company entirely and sold by Boots during the Christmas sales.